my message to them is this. Uh, don't do it. We don't want to tolerate it. Uh, we want you to take care of our park. We want to make sure that when you come visit our park that you uh, utilize it in a way where you're going to enjoy it. Sometime last week, vandals entered the Martin Park Airview Terrace Recreation Area and damaged several pieces of property. The park is located in City Councilman Roosevelt Johnson's district, and he says the act is senseless and works against what the city is trying to do. We have a lot of things uh, here at the park uh, that's family oriented. We want to make sure that it's maintained, that it's well kept uh, by the city, which does a great job. But we want to make sure also along the line that individuals who use this park don't vandalize it. The park is maintained by a recently passed recreation tax, money that Johnson says could easily be used in other ways. This has to be repaired. And, you know, we're using money uh, uh, that can be used elsewhere. We're using taxpayers' dollars to take care of this problem, to take care of what has happened here, when those resources can be used somewhere else. APD is currently working the case, but as of now, they don't have any suspects. The park is located in a residential neighborhood, so Johnson is pretty confident that somebody saw something. And if you have any information, he urges you to contact the authorities. If you know who did this, please call it in. Uh, call, uh, you know, Crime Stoppers always involved in helping our community, helping our city. Call it in the Crime Stoppers. Call uh, the Alexander Police Department. Bennett Rowland Jr., ABC 31 News.